So in this video, we're going to go through three examples of solving logarithmic equations. So for the first one, we have the natural log of x plus 3. Take away the natural log of x is equal to the natural log of 5. So with the left-hand side, we can use the quotient rule and write that as the natural log of x plus 3 over x. And that's equal to natural log of 5. Now, we can e both sides, or e to the power of both sides, and knock out those natural logs. Um, so the natural log of this is equal to the natural log of that. So these two things have to be the same. So x plus 3 over x must be equal to 5. Multiply up by the x. Subtract x from both sides. And then divide through by 4. So x would be equal to 3 quarters. Now you must double check, does that solve the original equation? And we're going to have 3 quarters plus 3, which is positive, so that's fine. And then the natural log of 3 quarters, that's fine. 3 quarters is positive, so that will solve the original equation there. So we're all good. Number 2. We have the natural log of 6 take away 5x is equal to 2 times the natural log of x. So the first thing to do is to bring that 2 up to the power. So use the power law here. So the natural log of 6 take away 5x is equal to the natural log of x squared. Then we can e to the power of both sides. We would have 6 take away 5x is equal to x squared. Move everything onto the right-hand side. And we're going to get 0 as x squared plus 5x take away 6. Factorise the right-hand side. So we would have x plus 6, x take away 1. So either x is minus 6 or x is equal to 1. Now check, do both of those solve the original equation? Well here we would have the natural log of minus 6 which clearly does not work. So that is undefined. So this is not a solution. How about x is 1? Well, log of 1 is fine. Log of 6 take away 5, so log of 1 there, is also fine. So x equals 1 is all good. So that is the only solution to the original equation. Right. Last one, we have the natural log of 2x minus 1 plus the natural log of 3x is equal to 2 times the natural log of x. So the left-hand side, we can use the product rule and write that as the natural log of 2x minus 1 times by 3x. And on the right-hand side, we can use the power rule to bring the 2 up to the power and write that as the natural log of x squared. So our left-hand side, multiplying out the bracket, will be 6x squared take away 3x. Then we could do e to the power of both sides, get rid of the logs. So we'll have 6x squared take away 3x is equal to x squared. Subtract x squared from both sides. Factorise that into a single bracket, so 5x take away 3 times by x is 0. So either x is equal to 3 fifths or x is 0. Now we need to check, do they both work? Well, x equals 3 fifths will work here, here and here actually. So two lots of 3 fifths is 6 fifths, take away 1, that's positive, so that's all good. So x equals 3 fifths works, but x equals 0 will not work. The natural log of 0 is undefined. So that is not a solution to the original equation. So x equals 3 fifths is the only solution to number 3.